In this video, I want to look at how you can start integrating ICT into your classroom. Many teachers are still reluctant to use new technologies in class. This is for a number of reasons. They're afraid that the students know more about technology than they do. They're uncertain about whether the technology will work. They often lack the training to know how best to use the technology. They don't have sound models on which to base their use of the technology. If you're in this position and you want to start using ICT, then a framework to guide you is the SAMA model. SAMA stands for Substitution, Augmentation, Modification, Redefinition, and it was introduced by Dr. Ruben Puentidura in 2006. SAMA is a tool for understanding how we can integrate ICT into our lessons and develop the way we use technology to have a transformative impact on learning. Let's look at the framework. Substitution. At this level, we're using technology in place of paper. The task remains the same, but a computer is used as part of that task. Here's an example. You find a text online and replace the text in your course book. Instead of reading a text in a book, your students read the text on the screen. There's no real functional change in what they're doing. Augmentation. At this level, we're using technology to replace a paper-based activity, but with some form of functional change or improvement. Building on the previous example of the replacement text, we also ask students to use some digital tools to mark up the text with notes, highlight specific areas to remember, and use an online dictionary to check the pronunciation of new vocabulary. Modification. At this level, technology allows for more significant task redesign. Again, building on the previous example, we now ask our students to share their reflections about the text on a blog. The posting is shared with the wider educational community. The students then comment on each other's posts. Then the students meet together in a virtual classroom to discuss or debate the content. Redefinition. At this level, technology allows for the creation of new tasks that were previously not possible in the traditional classroom. Building further on our previous example, students work collaboratively online to research the background to the text. They create a digital survey on the topic of the text and use it to carry out genuine research through their social media networks. They then analyze the data from the survey and work together to create a video report of their findings. The steps in this example show how you can develop the way you use ICT as your confidence and knowledge increase. My top tip is to tell your students that you're trying something new. Get their feedback and find out what they think about the activities you try. Show them that you're also trying to learn and develop your skills. 